Hello, YouTube. I'm gonna smell your hand. They're very good. And we're here for Zoo Tycoon 2. Okay, you do this. Okay, yep. Yeah. Just checking. Okay. Um, mini map, mini map. Your map. Mm. Well, I guess you could just like take a nice little look right now to the zoo. So, got tortoises, koalas, foxes. This is our rest area. This is our main food court. Um, water show. Um, so last episode we made these cute little red pandas. Now we have a bit of room left before the big de desert enclosure. Now we have this big area here. Now I think it's not. A, I don't think it's big enough to make a desert enclosure. Well, what's the matter? You can't make. It. Wallace. <sighs> okay, so I'm gonna do something. So let's pause this, shall we? Realize, okay. Um. So what I want to do is get this whole area as a path. Now. So a lot of you are probably thinking, oh, well, you're going to put another food court in there. Now, I'm not sure what I'm going to put in here. Now, our, the food court is just on the other side of this turtle enclosure, so I'm not sure I should um, put it just over there. Um, okay. Um... So, I think I'm going to actually set up the sky ride for this area here. Now, this is going to be something we're going to do for our last few episodes. If it's going to take that long to make, or our last episode. Now, we are almost done with this series. Um, I guess I can do the rest of that later. I just want to smooth it out. I One thing I don't like about this map is that in the end here, it's so bumpy. I mean, it's going to be physically impossible to put a path in here. So, I think all this area here is going to be animal cages. And then, any open space we have, I'm going to, over here, I'm going to put paths on. Um, uh, now I might put a little mini food court in here, or like a nice little resting area. Um, um, okay. Holy cow. Yeah, I was gonna say that'd be perfect. I mean I was gonna say I don't know what the choice. That is one high out path. So that, um, and then I might as well um um do some stuff with here. Um I'll add some restrooms. Okay, there's a gate there, so that's not blocking the gate to the koalas. Um, good, guess what my do, zoo. So, I might as well just real quick put a one there. So that's gonna be right here. And then, and then that, and then, so yeah, an elevated path. Um, now I have elevated paths, tanks. Um, I don't know if I would 
be use elevated paths. So I think I'm going wow, to get some. Okay. Um. Building, building, building. Let's get some uh, reuse, reuse, recycle stuff here. Huh? Um, no. benches maybe. Um. Uh, I'm not sure how this elevated path is gonna work. That looks terrible. I mean, it looks perfectly fine from up here, but you zoom in, and it's just yeah. Um, guess I'll put an ATM right here. Um, and I'll put um some kiosks, gift card there. Um, uh, some kiosks. Here's a kiosk. Here's another kiosk. That would be pretty neat to have something like this go, like, right here. Let's actually have that. Let's smooth this out. Oh, okay, so we may get to um uh, um putting out paths for um put making new animals. Sorry, I like lag. I like lag. No, I do not, actually. Uh, it puzzles me why you should be able to put this stuff in here on the paths. I mean, I suppose it makes a little bit of sense, but, um, let's get this compost building. It's, like, supposed to be good for the environment. Oh, jeez. It's like every time I place something down, I have these paths to flatten. Oh, well, I guess that's going to have to be... I guess we're almost done here. Let's make a very small area. Just two food, two drinks, and two dessert cars. Okay, so, uh, let's see here, let's see here, let's see here, um, I guess we can pause it, maybe we should get some stuff in here, how about two maintenance for three maintenance workers, um, and two edu- and two entertainers, a little dinosaur and a little guy. Let's get, you know, I probably should save this stuff for, like, and then let's get an educator in here. There. I don't 
understand why you can't make it. Okay, where do I put the food for the elephants? Come on. What is this? It's a lot of money. Wish you could make zookeepers clean all this up. Oh boy, it's a lot of balloons. So you're telling me all the balloons? Go here. You know this means that I'm gonna have to move all this stuff. Okay. So hopefully these balloons don't go in the way. In the way. I mean, I like these balloons, but I mean, they're cool. Are they infiltrating the cheetah cage too? Nope, looks like my cheetahs are good. A lot of cheetahs. <sighs> they have a big enclosure. I'm not too worried about them. Now, I feel like I need to... Uh, I assigned three zookeepers here the last episode because these guys had to poop a lot. I can still remember the large amounts of poop. Looks like our walruses are getting better. Um, muskox. These guys give a pretty overpopulated enclosure, but they're doing okay. I mean, muskox are hurting animals, so I don't see. I mean, I expect they'll get, like, uncomfortable with all these guys soon. Okay, so it looks like guests are starting to come and... Like, they're not going over here. Can they get there? Well, yeah, there are paths here, but I guess they don't really do too much. Another one. Oh, wonderful. Oh, wonderful. Okay. Um, okay, now I want to make an animal in my, so I have, so I pretty much have all this room for building before, and so I'm going to use up all this room, um, and then I'm going to do the desert enclosure and the ride, um, which is going to be nice. And then that's going to be the Ram's Bottom Zoo. So this is what guests see, apparently. Hmm. Well, you spawn here. So, did I put one of these in here? I suspect I did. Hmm. I'm going to check. Yep, right here. I actually, now that I think about it, I might put another one. On, um, over here. Okay, maybe that would be such a good idea. There we go. Okay. Night. Okay, so what was that? Okay. Oh my gosh, all these animals are pregnant. I can't keep up with it. Okay, so let's start over here. Now I have polar bears. Um, what are these? Giant sable antelopes. Um, those are for my desert enclosure. I have bongos. Oh, I have buffalo. <laughs> I think I am going to make a buffalo enclosure. Everybody loves buffalo. Let's put this. They need a relatively big enclosure, so... There. I'll give it up to there. 
Let's get some staff gates. You should plug it in before you even start playing. I'm not gonna put one there. Maybe I will. I'm just going to. What could possibly go around? Yeah, and then I say that and everything goes wrong. Okay, let's get all this. Okay, let's delete this acacia or whatever that is. I think it's an acacia. I'm not even gonna bother to check. But um, okay. So let's get some. Okay, guess I love my zoo. Guess I love my zoo. That's all I need to know. There's a squirrel. How wonderful. You know, I feel like I should add these trows. Trows. Is that another one of these? Okay. Okay, what toys do you guys like? Carrots. Salt licks. And whatever this is. Just put it there. Looks nice. Okay, so I am preparing to have a pop large population of buffalo. So I'm gonna put two of these down. Maybe even four. Oh boy. I think I know what Asian elephant. Okay. You guys are satisfied with that. I mean, you guys aren't even reproducing. What could possibly go wrong? Maybe you are. I don't know. I like you guys. You don't bother me. You just bother me. Maybe someone pooed and their pooed is so large. <laughs> okay. So I have three of those. Okay, wait, hold on. It's offensive. Okay. Okay, so, 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 so. Let's get, 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 get some. Plants, 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 plants. Let's get some flowers. Koalas. Oh, what's wrong now? Okay, what's the matter, guys? Oh, there's a koala. I don't see any poop around here. There goes another mask. Oh, the baby koala. I love it. Okay. Okay. What trees do you guys like? Big old buffaloes. So I'll add plenty of birch trees. Maybe that tree. I'll add that tree. And there, I'll add it there too. Now I want some water. You guys up for that? No. Oh, apparently I don't like water. I'll add four buffies. I think they have... I think they're good. So sign them a zookeeper and let's head on in there. Check out their buffaloes. Okay. Let's everybody. 
Okay, sorry about that, guys. Okay, so I had the buffaloes. Um, donation boxes. I put down the donation boxes, and I went into the buffalo cage, and I said hi to Mr. Buffalo. I'm gonna name you Mr. Buffalo. Are you Mr. Buffalo? Mr. Buffalo. I think that's how you spell it. Well, there, Mr. Buffalo. I don't see any poo. What's the matter with this exhibit? Jack Black is not having a very good day. <sighs> I understand, showbiz is pretty tough. Going to sniff American Bison too. Hey, it's Mr. Buffalo. Did you throw the sponge out? Yeah. Did you get a new one? I wonder what this is. Can I go in this? That'd be cool if I could go in that. Do you want to go in that? What are you wearing? Oh, you have a little walrus hat. Uh, I'm sorry, bud, but I don't think you can see much from there. Okay, guys. I suppose this is it for this episode. I think it's been going on long enough. How the heck did you get up there? Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Ah, I'm speechless. That was cool, but I'm speechless. Okay, okay guys, so let's review what we did. We made this whole area with a bunch of um, new additions, like a mini food court, restrooms, ATMs, etc. kiosks. And we made this buffalo exhibit, and we gave birth to Mr. Buffalo. There, no. There's Mr. Buffalo. Mr. Buffalo. He's a buffalo. And we satisfied countless numbers of guests with donation boxes. Okay, goodbye guys. Also, I have something wrong with my koalas. My koalas are dying. Oh, my tigers died of old age. You know, I suppose it was about time. I mean, I have tons of them, so... It may sound pretty cruel, but I think I have enough to... be able to go through that. Okay. Goodbye, guys. I will see you later.